first of all, this is my dad away from being home, you know what I mean? The one and only Jerry Jones. Um, how are you doing, Dad? Well, Adam, I'll tell you this. Uh, some of my greatest times were uh, when we had a chance, you played the Cowboys. I had a chance to be with you. Uh, we'd uh, be together when the ball was nearby. We'd be together when it wasn't nearby. But we're together, and what I'm proud of is how our relationship, how long has that been now? 20 yeah, years? 19 50, years. About 19 years. And uh, we still have the relationship uh, uh, going forward that we have, and I feel uh, like it was yesterday. And what I remember as much as anything was just how Adam, and every one of us, not just young people, should remember uh, that Adam was always working to improve, always working to improve. And the right kind of people, we were just talking about a couple of them, saw this good man inside this guy. And of course, he's that today and is a great, in my mind, one of the great examples of being in the NFL and just getting better. Two things. I had a chance to stay with Jerry Jones. Um, the catfish and the grits. Is it still the catfish? Or what, 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 what's, what's the food of the trait? Is hey, it no, still the catfish? Yes, still is catfish. And Adam did stay. Uh, at my place, uh, one of the night I get a call at two in the morning, <laughs> and he's been fishing, competing against Dion Sanders for who could get the biggest bass at night in Dion's boat, and they bet the boat, and Adam won the boat yeah. from Dion yes, for I the did. most fish, yes. and he had to call me at two in the morning and say, Jerry, I just won Dion's boat. Yeah, I Catch just want to say thank you, man for always being there for me, support me after football, after I left Dallas, when I called you the other day, getting on your nerves when you was out the country at fucking two o'clock in the morning, I just want to say thank you. And I didn't understand what you told me at first. And you told me, you said, Pac, I never forget this. I tell people this all the time. You said, you ain't doing that wrong. You're just doing it with your ass out in the street. That stuck with me and that changed my life, the way I think about things, the way I approach things. So man, I want you to know that. While we're here, I want to give you your flowers. I want to say thank you. What you did for me changed me mentally and personally as a person. So I want to say thank you, and I love you. You know that. I'll tell you one thing. Don't ever take a young man or a kid and give up on you. Because there is a man in there that can change things. That's you. He did. And he wasn't easy to give up on. <laughs> Love you. Thank you.